Beginning tonight with a legal defeat for homeless campers at one of the largest homeless camps on the Central Coast. Federal court ruling now gives the green light to the city of Santa Cruz to remove hundreds of homeless from San Lorenzo Park. With more on what happens next, we go to Action News 8 reporter Felix Cortez, who's reporting live for us tonight. And Aaron, more than 400 homeless people call that popular city park home. The city says they'll get plenty of notice when it's time to move out. A federal court ruling now allows the city of Santa Cruz to go in and clear the homeless camp at the Benchlands in San Lorenzo Park. But city leaders say there are no immediate plans to remove the homeless until alternative housing can be found. We will provide ample notice once that when once those plans are in place and so we want um, these we want the folks who are camping there to be able to land um, in another location and um, and we're not quite ready to make that move yet so. the injunction was issued against the city back in january at the peak of the covid pandemic when the vaccine was in short supply dispersing the homeless posed the health risk according to homeless advocates but tuesday a federal judge ruled that is no longer the case and lifted the injunction the city must act before the rains come. There is a natural timeline for the bench land. So when the rainy season comes, we cannot have camping there because of the flooding that happens. And so we do have a deadline. Keith McHenry, co-founder of Food Not Bombs, was a plaintiff in the case against the city. He's not surprised by the court ruling, but still declared victory. Well, the thing I think we're most proud of is that we gave people um, six months of safety during COVID um, by succeeding at the original injunction. I think that's landmark. Now, in an effort to address its ongoing homeless problem, the city council recently approved a new ordinance establishing the safe sleeping and storage program with the hopes of establishing more than 150 beds for homeless people. The city is still in the process of locating a location and an operator. Reporting from Salinas, Felix Cortez, KSBW, Action News 8.